we usually go to temples, pai pai, tapos magfold ng parang money, to burn it. We go from place to place to look for those manghuhula and feng shui. What were the practices that you were doing before you became a Christian? And then, ano yung binago mo? Ano yung nananawala nung naging Christian ka? Kasi um, before, we usually go to temples also, and as well as Catholic Church, ganyan. Um, and then, we always visit, every month we would visit our uh, ancestors, um, puntod, yung sa cemetery. And then, merong, ayun, yung pai incense, pai. Uh, pai pai, ganyan. Tapos magfo-fold nung parang money, ganyan, to burn it. So, yun, simula nung naging Christian na ako, I told them na, I'm sorry, I cannot do the pai pai anymore kasi uh, we don't believe, uh, as Christians, we don't believe in incense burning and the money for the dead, ganyan. Kasi once they're dead, they are, parang they cannot receive the money, they cannot smell the incense or ano. Mm-hmm, so, mm-hmm. yun, pumayag naman sila, kahit reluctantly. How about you, Ellie? Aside from feng shui, kumbaga everything, because my husband did not grow up with a father, so parang laging nakastick sa mind niya na sinasabi sa kanya na wala tayong sasandalan. So you have to make sure that ano, you won't commit any mistake in your decision making. Okay. So parang yun yung nag-stick sa mind niya. Mm-hmm. And um, during those times, my parents are, my, my dad is an atheist. And my, my mom is a Buddhist. So parang mix ano kami. So during Sundays, in the morning, we go to our clubhouse for Misa. And then after that, we will go to Ongpin, to temple for yon yung pwa pwe tiu cham and asking for the questions that he wants to ask mm-hmm. like that mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. and um, yeah yung ma incense so everything so we practice everything technically and even to the manghuhula so we we go from place to place to look for those manghuhula and feng shui and everything even the the things parang lahat ng mga mga ano pampaswerte we 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 buy it even parang parang there's a crystal ball na mayroon dragon inside that we have to order it from China na very expensive so dalawang ganon yon isa sa office isa sa bahay para to be sure and we have a very big altar during that time and in the morning my husband will burn the incense uh-huh. and then in the evening pag uwi niya ganon din so ako naman not so much kapag ka nakakalusot hindi ako nag ano pero pagka sometimes he will ask me to oh ikaw mag ganyan ganyan ganon so yeah during those times ganon yung um, background ng ano namin so halo-halo din na na religion so there are times when meron siyang nakilalang isang good friend from Thailand mm-hmm. so that friend brought him parang ano rin yung yung something from Thailand na yung parang maraming hands yon yeah like like so, a Buddha with many hands oh, sure. so we put that in in front of the altar also so halo halo mm-hmm. ganon parang to be sure na everything Anang. will be under control <laughs> like that you, you have everything already <laughs> yes, in your house yes yes eventually when we accepted Christ sa airport so when we came home the next morning na curious ako kung totoo yung husband ko nag-accept. Oh, mm-hmm. So, totally, he did not approach the altar. Oh. And um, that's when I realized, ay, totoo pala. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, my brother-in-law brought us, each one of us, a very big Bible. So, yung sa kanya, yung life application, and yung sa akin, yung simple English na, na malaking, ano din, Bible. And we, ano, we use that parang naging part of our packet book. Ganon. So whenever we have time, we we read parang as oh, if gusto namin yes. matapos basahin yung isang mm. buong Bible mm-hmm. in a day or or like that. 
So, so yun yung, that's what happened to us. Thank you for joining us today in our discussion. We hope we were able to enlighten you in some of the issues you are currently facing. If you have comments or suggestions, please drop us a note in the comments section. We would also like to take this opportunity to invite all of you to come join us and worship every Sunday here at Jubilee Evangelical Church. We have English services at 8.30 a.m. and 10.30 a.m., Amoy service at 10.30 a.m., Taglish service at 3 p.m., and you can also join us online through our Facebook and YouTube channels at 3 p.m. For more details, you may also check our website at jec.com.ph. We hope to see you again in our next episode here at Common Ground. May God bless us all.